Keep watching Charis TV. Why is it that there's a spirit that is sleeping with you? It's true. Are oh, you hearing me? Yes. Come on. Come out. Come on. There's a spirit that is sleeping with you. Yes, it's true. And it has affected your stomach. Yes. Going down to your private part. Yes. Huh? That's true. Sometimes there's something that is coming out down there. That's true. Huh? That's true. So is this spirit is this spiritual husband that is molesting you? Come out! Out, you demon! Come out! Out! Come on! Come out! Something is eating your blood. Here, yeah. God wants to deliver you because there's this spirit that makes you very tired. Jesus. My sister, there's a spirit here. Yes, it always makes you tired. Can you see this spirit that I'm putting? Look at this woman now when I point at her there. Can you see this woman? I'm pointing at the spirit. This spirit cannot hide. You always feel tired. It's true. It's not true. It is true. Eh? It's true. Is it your husband this one? Yes. Now you are like a lazy woman. Sometimes you don't even want to cook. Yes, Jesus. It's not true, my brother. It's true. Let me, let me hear. She doesn't want to cook this one. Yes, it's true. Many, eh? It's true. She doesn't want to cook many So times. they put a spirit of laziness here. This spirit is living here. She, she was going to cook. She will even cook things that he won't eat. <laughs> things that he would do Amen. like this. Because they want you to fight. Yes, because there's true. always argument in your house. Yes, we keep on fighting. Eh? We keep on fighting. And then whatever she says, it's, it's, I mean, it's, you, you have to agree. If yes. you don't agree, it's a problem. The pro she that, wants to, uh, it is as if everything has to be approved by her. Yeah, you are like a woman. Yes. Herself, she's a husband. Yes. So today, God is delivering her. Stand Amen. up, my sister, stand up. Amen. Stand up. So from today, this spirit is living her in Jesus' name. Amen. You must check yourself. If you are married, always, when you say something, it is not done, it is not done your way. You've got a demon. There's a demon that is ruling you. Because, especially if you're a wife, if you're a wife, you must also check what is that the husband wants. If now you enter, the spirit enters you, and you start to say, it must be done my way. If not, it's not done. It must be done your Even you, my brother, if you always say, yes, 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 you've got a demon. You are becoming a woman. <laughs> you are not supposed just to agree. Your wife must come to you and say, Daddy, Daddy. Your wife must call you Daddy, Papa. Mama, the issue of blood is giving you problems. Are you hearing me? Yes. Your menstruation is giving you problems. Yes. Huh? Yes. It comes and goes. Yes. There was a time it went away for a long time. Yes. Huh? So now it's like there's a spirit that is eating your blood. Yes. But I believe today God is setting you free. <laughs> You're free. God wants to set you free with this lady. You hear me? This year, I'm giving you three months. You understand? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, God will change you this financial problem. Amen. Because you are worrying too much. Yes, no. Uh, why now you try this, you are trying business, you are failing. You are trying to get this better job. It's tough. Yes, no. Uh, and there's an attack in your wife here. This attack, I break it. Amen. And I also set you free. This case of your family, of stagnation, is broken today. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Can you see, look at your wife here. I'm sure you have never seen your wife like this. Eh? Yes, eh? Yes, man of God. Did you ever see your wife like that? No. Eh? So can you see? You're in a church where the wife sometimes will do things that you have never seen. Like this. 
leave your wife, leave that wife. Let's, I want my brother to see what the wife, what is happening with the wife. Yes, yes. Look at this. Can you see the wife? Can you see, brother? Yes, ma'am. Did you ever see your wife like this? No. Eh? No. So you see? Can you see? Your wife is becoming Lipanzula now. You see? As you see your wife like this, God is turning around your situation. God bless you. Look here, I'm calling my brother. You came with a lady. Because the attack here, they put it in the lady. My brother, when he meet his wife, he get the attack. Are you hear what I'm trying to say? They can put attack in your child. A child behave. You curse your child, you get an attack. The attack, they can put it around to the people you love. You get an attack from them by how you behave on them. God bless. Congratulations. Go sit down. So the family, from today, be careful of the food. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, you hear me? Yes. When there's family gatherings, don't eat anyone's food. Okay. Oh, you hear me? Yes. You rather go and take food for yourself because the family now is too much divided. I say true. Oh, you hear me? Yes. The family now is too much divided. In fact, you, they thought you went to a sangoma, you took something. I'm telling you, they thought you took something and they don't know that you believe in God. You don't use anything. They are the ones that have taken something from Sangomas. They want to use it against you. Number two, where your church is, some people will rise against you. I stop it like that. You heard what I said? Huh? Yes. yes. Where's your sister? Yeah, in Kangala. Huh? Kangala. When was the last time you spoke with her? Come on. Come on. When was the last time you spoke with your sister? 2018. 2018? Yes. How many years now? 18, 19, 20, 21. Four years. Yes. So now, you know what is happening. Let's not speak much about it. But God who chose you will lift you up. My message for you is that from now on, don't eat anyone's food. Are you hearing me? Yes. Don't eat anyone's. You see how many times I'm saying it? I don't want it to be like what I was saying. You remember the message I was saying when I, 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 I came here? Yeah. I said, I told the lady, I said, this will happen. It's like she was not hearing me. So now from today, we don't want anything wrong to happen to you. Don't eat anyone's food. You know what is happening. You understand? Yes. Between you and the family. Yes. More especially. You're free, sir. God will make you an example.